Howdy folks, welcome to Cray Outdoors. Uh, today, I, I'm out here looking for safe ice. I actually had an errand to run um, out here in Allegheny State Park. And uh, I didn't expect Red House Lake to be safe, but there are tracks and uh, people have clearly been fishing it this week. So um, we're gonna give it a shot. My plan was actually to head to Pennsylvania where I know that the ice is safe on the one reservoir. But uh, I think I'm gonna start off here at Red House Lake, give it a shot. Uh, hopefully we don't fall in and uh, we'll just make our way uh, to that reservoir in Pennsylvania. The uh, You can see I've got my <clears throat> crazy thick hat on right now. It is extremely, extremely cold out there. So uh, I'm going to be using uh, my GoPro instead of my Contour Roam because A, I don't want my Contour Roam to freeze up on me. And B, it doesn't, you can't really put the hat mount on this uh, or the, the helmet strap on this big crazy hat very easily and get it to stay. So... Uh, I'll be using my GoPro in its waterproof, freeze-proof housing um, on the chest mount. So audio is not going to be the best for this video. It's going to be like my old ice fishing videos. But uh, later on in the day, it's supposed to warm up a little bit. It's supposed to warm up to around 30 degrees. And uh, hopefully I can then uh, wear my lighter hat and uh, put on the contour roam. So we'll see. We're going to start off here at Red House and give it a shot. And... Uh, I don't know. Who knows? The first ice is usually uh, the best, and this is first ice. So let's see what we can catch. Well, obviously other people have been out here, but before I get into full-on ice mode, I want to make sure that the ice is at least remotely safe. I like three inches. Feels safe. <laughs> inches three three and a half inches of of uh, black ice and an inch of white ice plenty safe cool first bite come on baby let me get our first fish of the ice season here so far today. This one's looking. Come on. There's definitely a fish down there. This is a small one. I'm not going to get him on film. He's got a fish. Where the heck did he find a fish? Oh, let's see if I can get him on film with this thing. Come on, come on. He's going to go in the water. There's a mink. A mink with a fish in his mouth. Neat. Where the heck did he find a fish? Man. Well, missed one bite, marked some fish. Saw a mink, that was cool. But uh, we're going to head out towards Pennsylvania where I know I can find some fish. Alrighty, well, you're now at Lake X, we'll call it. I don't know, there's two random fishing poles chilling here, and no people around. It's kind of sketchy. I don't know if someone got sketched out and dropped them there or what, but uh, I don't know, I guess I'll take them with me if they're still here when I leave and somebody can claim them. Anyway, let's check the ice thickness. Place isn't really much of a secret, but okay. That hole is already good to go. Actually, he's less ice here than Red House. It's interesting. Looks like it's still plenty safe though. Looks like we got about yeah well, three and a half inches. That's about my cutoff anyway. <laughs> I think we'll head that way and catch some fish, hopefully. First flag of the 2016-17 ice season. It's just been in pretty good a second ago. I don't remember what's on this one. I think this one's a night crawler. Oh 
man, it looks like he dropped it already. It? Nah, I think he dropped it. Yeah. Nope, he's still on there. Oh, now he dropped it. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> no, he's on there. He's on there. He's on there. It's not very big. Oh, really? It's a little brown. <laughs> nice. Oh, cool. They stocked them just today? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Flag number two. Sun's starting to go down, finally starting to get some bites. Got one little trout. Guy gave me some interesting information. Apparently this reservoir was stocked today. I didn't realize that on the stocking report. We're supposed to stock it. They are supposed to stock it a couple weeks ago, but apparently got postponed to today. So mm -mm. Definitely dropped it this time. Put on a new butter worm and the flag's up again. This time he's not letting go. He's on there. Got him, another smaller one. Uh oh. Ooh. Alrighty, this one didn't swallow it, so I think I'm gonna release him. Got a bad sized brown trout. About the same size as the other one. According to that guy, the, that last brown trout I caught is small compared to the ones that they stocked. That one was about the same size, so I'll let him go. Alrighty. The camera just made a weird beep. Hopefully, I'm still recording alright. This is probably the last flag of the day. There was just a breeze. It's possible this is a wind flag. Doesn't look like it's moved at all. <laughs> Question is, was it a wind flag? Definitely doesn't seem to be anything on it. I think we got our one flag. Alrighty, well, there's our one fish, our dinner for tonight. Well, one of two fish, the other one I threw back. Pretty slow first ice day. I spent, uh, boy, probably six, seven hours at least, I'd say, today out on the ice. So it was a pretty slow day just too little for just too little trout. But, uh, hey, I caught some fish uh, for... December we have safe ice. I'm not complaining. Um, I've actually got the next couple of weeks off from work So uh, I got a game plan now. I didn't realize this place was actually stocked today I thought it was stocked a couple of weeks ago right before ice on and uh, I never do well Right after a place first gets stocked. I usually give it up give the fish a couple days to get acclimated at least in lakes and ponds and creeks uh, the trout acclimate a lot faster, but um, yeah, if I'd have known that I'd have stayed at Red House um, Red House I fished right during the middle of the day. It might have been a different story if I had fished there in the evening. So, uh, hey, we got two safe places in the area. I'm definitely going to be doing some more ice fishing this week. So, more ice fishing videos coming. And uh, be sure to subscribe if you've not already.